Steve. Nathan. Do you like yachts? Yeah. You do? Yachts, yeah. Oh, well, well that got off to a good start. Because <laughs> I've got a game for you. I was expecting you to say no, and oh. then I was going to go through <laughs> a whole list of different mechanics in this game until you said yes to something. And then I was going to say, have I got a game for you? We made it very easy, and now I've just gone and ruined that whole bit. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so, uh, welcome to Nathan Plays Games. Uh, this is Velvet Sundown. Uh, I'm joined by Steve. Hello, Steve. Hello, Nathan. How are you? Uh, I'm good. And you? <laughs> yeah, good. Excellent. So, uh, Velvet Sundown has been out for a little while now, and uh, it's kind of amazing. I've been telling Steve about it in the last couple of weeks. Yeah. So, funny. <laughs> for this first video, I thought let's let's drop in the deep end and uh, see what he makes of it. Uh, I'm going to be controlling it, but uh, and do the typing. But Steve, you can help me uh, decide what to say. Okay. All right. So I'm going to join uh, this game here, which should hopefully load relatively quickly. We just need <laughs> at least one more person. Uh, so this is a free-to-play game. Uh, yeah, it's been out a few weeks, and it. I started playing it because it sounded like a complete novelty, and <laughs> and it was, and I didn't know what the hell was going on in my first game. I didn't even quite realise that the other people on this yacht were being controlled by people, because it was all a bit strange, especially with a text of voice. Uh, but it's actually quite good. Yeah. I've sunk too many hours into this game. Right. Um, yeah. So. Well, we've got about two minutes in line, unless two people, uh, two more people join and then it'll start instantly. So I'll explain it a little bit. Yeah. Uh, there's a group of people on the yacht. The yacht is uh, the Velvet Sundown. Okay. And it's uh, kind of a role playing game. You've got to uh, kind of be your character. Uh, the only real mechanic in the game is talking to people. Right. Uh, and you can interact with them with the items that you, you have or can collect. Oh, here we go. Oh. Alright. So let's see who we are. This game's really strange. Right. It's very <laughs> strange. What kind of strange? It's strange in a good way. Good. It's very entertaining. I think it's quite well made. Um, it's, it was better than I thought it would be. But it all depends on the people you're playing with. Yeah. Because you get some really annoying people who just go... <laughs> just mess around. Yeah. Or say tremendously inappropriate things. Oh. <laughs> oh. Especially if you play as a woman, i found. Oh. But we are Jack. Yeah, I know that their names before it comes up. Jack Gold. Jack Gold. Your reputation as a successful businessman is well earned, but your green blind... Your greed blind... <laughs> you have the problems developing in the world market. So, let's see. Um... You have ended up working as an undercover agent for Exblon. Uh, you have been sent here to find information about the plans of rival company Balboil. Uh, okay. So basically, everyone, nearly everyone, on this yacht is a spy. Right. <laughs> and you're the greedy one. Uh, well, I'm, I'm the drug dealer one. <laughs> oh, nice. So e each character's got their own little thing. And this one, he's got a drug called Balboil and he wants to share it. So, this is the game. Uh, so I can just walk around and all these other people are being controlled by other human beings. You click on a uh, person to get into a conversation. So let's say hello, Boyle. Uh, how are you this fine evening? <laughs> you know, you could keep things, start things out civil. Yeah. There's, so, if there's six people here, I couldn't, I didn't see how many people joined the game, then four will be spies. Right. Uh, one will be innocent, and will just be there enjoying the yacht, yachting. Uh, and one will be um, a thief with a taser. Okay, Mary's joined the conversation. Ooh. So, hi Mary. All the... Oops. The, uh, the text to voice stuff was so good in this because each character had their own accent, their oh, own right. voice. So Jack was uh, like this Southern American, or uh, this deep south of, oh, of right. North America. Um, and he's kind of a sleazy businessman. 
Uh, that passport? Passport. Boot. <laughs> oh, I'm looking at Mary, but I'm talking to Boyle. <laughs> oh, right. Oh, yeah. So each character's got their own thing. Um, so mine is the, the drugs. Yeah. Mary needs to collect passports. Boyle will need to serve drinks. And then you've got one added one on top, which for me is being a secret agent for Exblon. Right. The names in this are quite poor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really. But never mind. Because it's Bal Boyle is the other company, and Bal Boyne oh, is the drug I've got. I don't know. Oh. Thanks for the whiskey, bro. <laughs> Like people's drinks with you. Uh, no. Oh, that's no fun. W what do we do for a living? Go on. Drug dealer, aren't we? No, oh, yeah, we didn't. Businessman. Businessman, okay. Sorry. <laughs> I travel all around the world. You can't just straight up tell people, what do you do for a living? Oh, I'm a drug dealer. <laughs> of course you can. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. You're in the army. <laughs> <laughs> Not from that inside yacht. Okay, you can travel with the army. Have you? Oh. Yeah, see the world. <laughs> On the left of the screen here, we've got our two yeah. objectives. There you can get more, depending on what happens. It's not my deal shooting and stuff. Fair enough. Uh, so I need to get someone high. Oh, right. What your deal is. So let's see if we can convince Boyle. Should we say it has something like, like good, um, uh, let's hmm. say cures it. Oh, is um, that's a good one. Oh, it's done though. Oh, I can't. And uh, maybe he wants to chat as well. And Malik. All right. There's uh, five of us here now. Yeah. Something hard enough to make me regret it in the morning. <laughs> well, that's. <laughs> oh, well, Mary's being struck up front. I need info. Who has it? So, technically, the aim is to to get this the data for your company as your spy to to sabotage the other company. Oh right. Uh, you're supposed to do it in secret, hence you know spy and secret yeah. agent. But some people are just like, yeah, I'm an agent. <laughs> who has the data? So. Uh, That's some weird film, isn't it? Yeah, it's it's re it's even stranger when the voices are working. Yeah. Uh, because it's because people type in random stuff and it's it's pretty good the text to voice yeah. stuff. Oh, <laughs> there we go. It only took four minutes. <laughs> Malik, That's very forward. <laughs> You should calm down. Right. Cool. Let's see if we can get Malik to uh, do some bow boy of Malik. This is illegal. Of course, the camera does get a bit confused sometimes. Yeah. Let's see. Is he gonna? Yes, he did the drugs. Nice. There we go. Jack and Malik drift away to the spirit world. They face their inner demons and dance the mambo with them. <laughs> of course. Uh, let's see. That's some... Uh, some good shit, right. Oh, and Ingmar's here. Got some strange names, haven't they? I've never encountered anyone called Ingmar. No, me neither. I think I've heard of Malik. Yeah. 
Uh, uh, Malik would like to bless you and make you his disciple. No, he's got to work for it. <laughs> oh, and um, there we are. I've pushed him away. And <laughs> Boyle and uh, Ingmar over there are kind of fusing. <laughs> One. Uh, sorry, Malik. So one of these people here uh, is the kind of innocent one, the one who is only has their, like I have the drugs, they have their own thing, oh, right, and yeah. it's not anything to do with the secret agent stuff. He's work on the boat, or just on the boat. Oh, just on the boat. Yeah. And they will have the data, they will find the data, so you've got to figure out who it is. Ah. Oh. Um, right, done there. Like, causing... Oh. Pretty much. <laughs> let's see, I think we can let's have a drink with Dunder. <laughs> there we go. So that's something weird about this game, I don't know why. Look at all it's just invisible, all the items are invisible. <laughs> so we are just I don't know, moving our hands. That was oh uh, some tasty Invisible whiskey. <laughs> oh, that sounds cool. Do you want to try some? I still have some left. It is the finest. Oh. It's the bee's knees. <laughs> okay. Oh, what? <laughs> so at some point, there's there's 23 minutes left in this session. All oh, right. In this game. So at some point, we actually got to get onto the secret agent stuff rather than yeah. just getting drunk and, and getting high. <laughs> See? Uh, I wish I could pay for it. Maybe you can. I don't suppose. Let's see if we can probe Dunder for information. Yeah. Okay. So Depending on who who, who you, you talk to, sometimes they're really helpful, or sometimes yeah. they just won't cooperate <laughs> whatsoever. Uh. But at least I haven't been tased yet. So we need the data. Yeah. Should we? Let's not accept Boyle no, yet, right because talking about that. Ain't it? Yeah. Okay, I'm listening. Okay. Let's see what she has to say. So, I've got a CID there, which all the spies have. Yeah. Which is exactly what she's about to. So you can, if you use that on someone, if they have one. I have two types of ID, in fact. Yeah. Because I've got that, the, um, the CID and my passport. But I don't really want to give her my passport. <laughs> She might nick it and give it to what's her face. Yeah. <laughs> so, what do you reckon? Shall we reveal ourselves as a secret agent to Donna? Ooh. 
Oh, no. Yeah, what's the worst that could happen? So, that's just going to count down. Oh, she claims she doesn't have a CID. She claims she's not a secret agent. Oh. Why do you have the information? Uh, I don't know. Oh. It's it's all it's all up in the air at the moment. Oh. That's that's the mystery of the thing. You've got to find <laughs> out by talking. Unfortunately, I have a, don't have a device. Yeah. Oh, so it looks like she may be the thief, because when you taste people as the thief, you can steal data. Oh, there we go. Oh, sorry. So, uh, I like the sale of this info, it's been more of my while. I can give you a good amount. So, I've got $100,000 in money or in cash. Yeah, it's it's just one item. Oh, uh, so you can't really you just give it to them, and a constant supply. Repeat. Yeah, of <laughs> let's just say weed. Should we, okay, it's your choice. Should we say Exploron tend to be the evil ones, which is what I work for. Should I be honest, or should I say Balboil? I think, actually, I think we should be honest. Really? Yeah, because she's, if she's not working for either, then it doesn't really matter. Oh, yeah, that's true. Oh, she does have the data. Oh. That's what we're after, isn't it? Yes, but she only showed it to us. Oh. <laughs> you should tease, aren't you? Oh yeah. <laughs> let's see if we can. Uh, let's see. Would oh. There we go. Let go on. Or do I? Or is she going to make me pay? Oh, there we go. Hey, take the disc. Uh, I've come into possession of a disc from my employer, Explon. Uh, this disc contains instruction for me and my fellow agents. They too need to get this information immediately. So there's another Explon person on this yacht, and I've got to find out who it is. Oh. Uh, to share the news. Fair enough. So she wants us to go and get her passport back from uh, Mary. Oh, okay. So far, all the people in this game have been relatively well behaved. Yeah. Only Malik's been <laughs> uh, trying to. Quite on of everyone. Yeah. Isn't it? <laughs> so, oh dear. So, can you see Mary there? It's kind of in a strange position. Yeah. That means the person has quit out of the game. Oh. So, that she's no longer playing, which means I can't get the passport back. <laughs> So, I got stuff, don't you? What I need to do is let's see if we can. <laughs> okay. Right there. I'll... Oh, <laughs> should I say thank you? Yeah. <laughs> I do look after myself. <laughs> uh, I like your moustache. <laughs> What's a kiss? I think he does. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, this is pretty much what Velvet Sundown has become. <laughs> Fair enough. Right, I actually want to, let's talk to, oh. 
She's talking to Boyle, but I need to. Okay. I need to try and persuade her and give her drugs and money for that other disc. Are there two discs? Yes. Oh. Mary is fucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like her uh, consciousness has <laughs> to another world. Trying to stay in character rather than saying mm. the guy quit or the person quit. Oh. Oh, look, she just. Oh, wait. There we go. Don is very cooperative. In yeah. This. Okay. So this is going well. Yeah. Okay. We're one step away from completing all of our stuff. We just need to now. find the other agent. Oh look, <laughs> knock yourself out, go cause some chaos. Don't mind if I do. Dunder don't <laughs> care. Okay. She just wants to party, don't she? So, we've got Boyle, we've got Ingmar, and we've got Malik over there. Who should we talk to? Who do you think is the agent for Exploron? Our fellow agent. Gonna bloke in the background, if I remember his name. Malik. Yeah. Let's talk to Malik. Oh. He's kind of creepy. With that tattoo, that yeah. head tattoo. <laughs> Actually, should we talk to Ingmar because they're all in a conversation oh, yeah. and we want to talk in private. We don't want everyone... Actually, or do we want to talk to Ingmar because he might yeah. try and seduce us? Again. Again. <laughs> he's got to work for it this time, though. Oh, he reject... He's trying to talk to Mary, but the person controlling Mary is no longer in the game, so he's not going to get much luck. No. I tried to have a game of this last night. I haven't played it in a while. Yeah. And within five minutes, everyone had quit out, and I, it was just a ghost ship. <laughs> it was just me left. <laughs> I was chat now. There we go. Uh, hello, my good sir. Do you want to okay, Do you want to dictate this conversation? Ooh, maybe. Right. Bit of both. Both. Okay. Okay. What should I say? How is he? Who's <laughs> it first? Yep. Sure. Read your own. Let's see what he has to say. Is he gonna? Is he gonna keep it appropriate? What's your bet? Is he gonna say something horrible? Oh! Oh! How are we? Pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. Look at that gesturing. So. <laughs> Uh, why? Let's... Ah. Let's just see, let's just be a bit forward here. And see if... Yeah. We can get him... To share which company he works for. Because, if he works for x I just need to give him the two data disks that I've got. Because I've already got the info from them. Unless he lies. Oh, no, but I'm going to make him confirm with his... Always, oh, alright. Just is uh, it, okay. Ingmar wants to test a strange device on you. Should we let him test it on us or not? <laughs> yeah, go for it. Yeah, uh, okay. Let's see what happens. Ingmar presses the device against Jack and pulls the trigger. An electric current shoots through Jack's body and he collapses on the floor. Jack oh. is out for the count. Very nice. We have to be a bit careful of Donna now. Why? Because if she has a taser, uh, she wants to speak to us. If she has a taser, and if she tased us, then she would steal back that data. Oh, she's gonna do it, isn't she? Uh, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. Uh, nope. That's all I've got in the bottom there. 
That's better. <laughs> Knock out eight passports. Oh, do tell. Malika. Okay, so it, well, it is Ingmar. Oh, right. I think, well. Awesome. Fantastic. She, she is really good she, help. She, she is very helpful. <laughs> Okay, so she's got she had two lots of each of the, of the data. Yeah. So we've got one of each. So she still has one of each. But she says she'll give them one, and I've got to choose. So should I? So this, both these companies are trying to attack each other's yeah. oil rigs for some reason. So do we let her give them the one that will prevent them from us attacking, or the one where we can attack them but they'll attack us? It doesn't really work. Um. How about neither? I will give you money. I would. Ooh. Because if she could. But, if I get all of them, then I can just go and give the other two to Ingmar, even if he's if it was Mary who was the X-Prime person. Yeah. And I can still mess with him. Dunna, you are awesome. <laughs> I'm, I'm, oh. Yeah. Okay, so we got, we have all the data. But this is going well. Yeah, so what we do is talk to I can give it to him. Uh, so I'm gonna give Done all of my drugs. Oh no, I've, oh, I've still got some. That way, when they share, that won't work because they'll just win if they do that. Yeah. Let's just see. Uh, that's true. I need to find Ingmar first. Oop. Shall I give her some money? He's been very helpful. Because I don't have any objectives to do with money. No. Wish I had that much money. <laughs> <laughs> Go find Ingmar. Alright, I think I saw him go down here. Yeah. It'll be just just my luck that it will go down there and he'll quit out as well. <laughs> uh, let's see. He's not here. It's a nice yacht, isn't it? Sorry? It's a nice yacht. It's a very nice yacht. Is he in the cupboard? No. <laughs> Hung himself. <laughs> He just felt so bad after tasing me yeah. with that makeshift device. Where is he? Uh, is he there's a bunch of people out there. There he is. Oh, good. Oh, they're all out here. I should give it to the right person. But, so, I'm not going to give it in, and I can't give it to them in front while spending yeah. a conversation with all them because it will come up in the text bit. Yeah. They will see. Oh, there, there, I think Ingmar just received Malik's blessing. I don't want to talk to you, Boyle. Go away. Boyle. You, uh... Duck. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to get on me. I need to talk to Ingmar. Go on, Ingmar. Go on, just accept the conversation and we can win the game. Good giant. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, he's talking to Dunler. Dunler will accept. Hey. 
So hopefully, yay! He was the Explan agent. Yay! Uh, but Bob's plans to sabotage my employer's oil rig has been shared with my fellow agents. Safety measures are being put in place, and our oil rig is safe. All right. So now, if I give him the Explan one, and hopefully he'll take that as well. Now we can blow up their oil rig. Nice. But. He's got his hand up to his chin there, which means he was in that little animation thing that we were just in. Oh, right. Just like this. And in fact, like, pretty much everyone is. <laughs> Everyone's just like, hmm, because this has just come up on everyone's screen. Oh, right. Yay, we win! Ha! Ah, Malik, your oil rig lies in ruin. <laughs> we can just gloat now. The next four minutes. Sorted. X one wins. Oh, the <laughs> best. What a good little game, really. <laughs> oh, Malik, there. I'm undercover. <laughs> no shit. <laughs> See, it had, when it had the voices, it gave that extra thing oh, because yeah. it was so funny. But you've actually seen a relatively proper game of this. Yeah. Sometimes it's just as ridiculous with you can people. Move it around and... Yeah, like nobody's been tased in this, and you can. Yeah. And uh, Dunder, uh, her objective usually is to try and get people to adopt a child. <laughs> so she ten tends to be the most annoying character because <laughs> to us pester you, go, adopt this child, and it will just keep coming up. Oh God. For you. Let's talk to Boyle. He, he said he wanted to speak to me earlier. So I could just wind them up now and give them the data because it's now worthless. <laughs> Shouldn't he be behind the bar? Who? Shouldn't he be behind the bar? Well, he, he he can he has all his drinks in this in his bar like oh. this. So somewhere on his person, he's concealing an infant amount of beer, whiskey and Bloody Marys. I don't know. I don't want to know where that is. <laughs> <laughs> well, you've, you've seen how this game works. Everything is invisible. Oh, yeah. He could be carrying a massive bar, like a mobile <laughs> yeah. bar on his back. <laughs> oh, here we go. Hello, Boyle. Shall, shall I just give him everything? Yeah, why not? I'll give, I'll give him the data. Just tell him we're playing hard, hard to get as well. <laughs> Let's give him our... Oh, maybe we, he's... is he in the thinking thing? Maybe I shouldn't have given him the data. <laughs> All our stuff is safe now anyway, and we've already blown up there, so I don't think anything wrong is going to happen. Huh. Right, uh, you took that. Code. Let's give him my passport. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> Take everything we already won. You were it. Um, I was it. <laughs> I'm always it. I'm the shit. <laughs> I'm the shit. Oh. <laughs> on the site. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give him some drugs as well. Yeah. <laughs> Mad with power. And whiskey. Oh, and that's it. Hey, we won. That was good. Quest complete. Explon successfully completed the plans to sabotage Balboyle oil rig and is now burning to ashes. Additionally, the plans of Balboyle to sabotage your employee's oil rig have been found out. As expected, attack, uh, an, expe an expected attack on Explon's oil rig has been reported, but because security was prepared for the attack, uh, was prepared, the attack failed miserably. Very good job, Agent. Damn yeah. right. Get pay rise now. Yeah. 
so now uh, on the right here, these are all the people's names, like actual names, or well, Steam names. So yeah. like mine and this is under Jack. That was fun. Mary, sexy Hitler. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> I don't think Hitler could be sexy. No. Uh, I've seen worse <laughs> names on this, believe it or not. God. Okay, so let's leave. So, that's been sun uh, Velvet Sundown. I like this game. Yeah. Yeah. That's quite interesting, really. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching.